Okay, y'all. So, I forgot if I even picked up the camera today to vlog. But today is Tuesday, November 15th. Listen, y'all. Our mother job is never freaking done. So, I got off work. Cheer competition is over. So, I had to come to drop my daughter's cheer uniform off. Because the season is done. If I didn't bring it back, we were going to be charged. Um, and today was my only day, but guess what? It's pouring down right now. So I had to walk all the way from my car, all the way across the field, just to do this. And it's cold. It's like freezing rain. It's not regular rain, it's freezing rain. And I couldn't come tomorrow. Cause tomorrow is a long day. I guess we'll show tomorrow. I leave. No, I leave tomorrow. I have school. Then I have work. And then I'm gonna try to make it to church. But then it's time to pay for my trip. Cause I leave Thursday afternoon. Um we'll be in Miami for a night. One night only. I'm from out of town. And then we'll be on a cruise on our way to the Bahamas. So it's really pretty out here. Oh, I don't know if it's a lightning on my phone, but it's giving, y'all. <laughs> so I'm on my way home and I'll check on the car later or tomorrow. It's cool. Hey, y'all. So I'm finally home. I don't even remember if I picked up the camera today. Because today was just a busy day. I had to run some errands before work. After work, I went to church for Bible study. So now I leave for my trip tomorrow. So I'm about to pack for my trip. I think I'm at, I might end this one here. I don't know. I got to see how much content it is even for me to post it. But I think I'm going to end it here. And then pick up for my trip for tomorrow. So um, I don't know. We'll see. But I need to. I'm already packed pretty much like. Don't don't mind my ways, y'all. They my friends. <laughs> but I'm already packed up. Listen, y'all gotta save these bags. But pretty much, I'm already packed. It just gotta go in a suitcase, and I gotta finish it up. So we about to get this started. It is now. I took my watch off. What time is it? I think it's like 10:45. So we about to make that happen. And we going to be it because I gotta get up at six o'clock to wake my daughter up for school before I leave. So yeah, so time to get this night started and i'll check in with y'all soon all right y'all so i'm sitting on the floor but i'm gonna do a little target run you know trip essentials so you know we need the clorox wipes i always wipe down even before covid happened i always wipe down um like my room like the shower the bathroom the toilet any room i stay in i always wipe it down so Y'all know these are essential. I had got some else from um, Target, but I think it's too far back. I don't feel like I want to get it. Um, of course, your toothpaste, travel size, Vaseline, and the cocoa butter kind, if you know, you know. And this is my favorite tree scrub. It's the vitamin C one, but y'all, it smells so good. <sighs> Mine's was an empty, but it was low. So I figured I'm going to take my low one with me on vacation and then have my re-up for when I get home. And then, so I don't know if y'all know, I don't know if this is new or not. Well, this this scent isn't new, not flavor. This scent isn't new. But they came out with like the shea butter to it, but I do not like the smell of the um the shea butter like this smells way better than the shea butter or whatever lotion that they got now i wasn't a fan it just smelled like this but like 10 times stronger like this is like subtle and i actually like this scrub i don't know what's the difference but i like this scrub better than like the other scrubs this one is like more gentle the watermelon ones and all those other ones to me it's just like a little rougher, and I don't really like that. So, this is my go-to. This is the vitamin C one. And then, I picked up this one. I don't know if this one 
is a new scent, but um, this one is Tropic Glow. And it smells. So this one right here, this might be my, my other favorite too. Yo, this smells so good. It gave me like Bath and Body Works, but like a, I don't know, this one smells good. And this one doesn't feel as rough as like the other ones. So I had picked that up. Oh, also too, they have the, um, is a whipped shea body butter for that one. And this one smells good. I might use this in the morning. I might. Yeah, this smells too good. Yeah, I'm going to wear this um in the morning. It's not going with me on vacation, but it smells. Look, I'm trying. Look, I'm holding it up to the camera like, honey, you'll smell it. But like the consistency of it, you see how it's not like too. You know how shea butter sometimes people be trying to make shea butters and it be like, it's either too thick or too loose. Like, it look like a perfect blend. Let me see. Oh, yeah. And it feels good. It's not, like, too crispy or something. Yeah, it's not too... It's not too, um... I said crispy. <laughs> it's not too, um... Like, watery. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It smells good. Yeah, I'm wearing this if I get out the shower. <laughs> um, and you know what a cotton L, cotton L wipes, you know, to the bed for me. No, you know, you know, I gotta be clean. And y'all know we need hand sanitizer. I had to re-up on some. This isn't for the trip because I already have some, but I like to always re-up on hand sanitizer. I'm a little germaphobe, and this was before everything. And I work in a hospital too, so I just be like, yeah, nah. So, that was my little haul, y'all. Um, so, I'm almost done packing. I'm about to put my shoes shoes in here, toiletries in here, um, and then whatever last minute stuff. I'm taking my computer with me. Um, I don't know if I'll do schoolwork, but, you know, if it's ever downtime, I just like to be productive with my time away, even though I'm away and I'm supposed to be relaxing. But sometimes on vacation, that's all you really get to is relax is when you're away or catch up on some things so i'm bringing my computer with me um my sunglasses always go in my personal item with me because i know they ain't gonna be throwing around my bags with my sunglasses in there so that always comes with me so i gotta figure out what bag i'm gonna take for my carry on because i think my zipper broke the last time i went away so i gotta figure out what bag i'm gonna take for my carry on but something that's not too heavy, but they can fit my legs up. I don't know, but um, I'm almost done packing. I forget what, I don't even know what time it is. And my other phone is too far, but I'm going to finish up and I check what pick it in with y'all when I finish or maybe in the morning. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> just got to Miami on my way to go find something to eat I leave my cruise tomorrow so you're just checking in stay tuned for the vlog Sports bra and some leggings, and yeah, that's what I got on. So, 
Right now we about to go meet up with everybody, get some food and some hookah. And then yeah. So good morning y'all. It is Friday, November 18th. Um still in Miami. I'm about to leave for my cruise today. Um I just had breakfast. Um so I'm a little addicted to hookah. Well, I ain't gonna say addicted, but I'm trying to cut off a hookah come 2023. That's one of my goals or whatever. So um, before I go on a cruise, of course, you can't have hookah on a cruise. So I was looking for some hookah before I left it go on my cruise. So, so um, I don't know if the music is going to be an issue in the background, but I leave to go on my cruise today. I spent one night in Miami. Um, I leave to head to the cruise. We gotta be there between 12.30 and 1.30. So we have enough time. Um, we have the hotel room till 12 is 11.25. So I got a little bit of time. Um, my hotel is only around the corner from the strip where I'm at. And um, so I'm out there sniffing some hookah and get myself to the cruise. I'm so excited, y'all. This is my first cruise. I hope it, I hope it meets my expectations of what I'm hoping it will be. I look, y'all. It's so nice out here. It's beautiful. It's like the perfect weather. It's not too hot, not too cold. I only had this little jacket on. Well, it's a denim shirt, but I only have it on because it's cold. Well, it's not cold, but where I was sitting, it was cold, so I just threw it on real quick. But it's actually perfect weather out here. So I'm at the Get my hookah here back tomorrow and then I'll check in with you in a little bit. Good morning, y'all. So I forget what day of the. What the hell am I saying? Anywho, I forget what day of the vlog this is, but um, oop, we had a change of plans for where we supposed to land. So we were supposed to be in Bahini, Bahamas, if that's how you say it, but it had to because of a bad storm in Bahini. We're now in Freeport. So where we would have had the whole day from eight to five or something like that. Now we only had from 12 to 5.30 to be on this island, but it's raining here too. So I don't know how much fun they will really be. And to be honest, if it's raining and, and it's a little cold, so if it's raining cold and chilly and stuff like that, like to be honest with you, I might not even get off the boat and it just sucks because I've been to Nassau Bahamas before. But I've never been to Bahini, so I was excited for that. And now we in Freeport. Um, supposedly Freeport is supposed to be, um, I don't know what they said. I think they said not as touristy, but from what I'm looking at so far, you know when you want a cruise, they tell you don't really like go to, away too far and stuff like that. Like they say, you know, don't go too far because you never know when it's going to leave. But where we at right now, it looks kind of touristy. Like, people are still selling things and stuff like that. So, I wanted to see more of, like, sand and stuff like that right now where we at. I don't really see any sand. Like, there's no beach. It's just, I guess, just the seller. It, it looks kind of like a, a I'm not going to say a flea market, but like a seller's market. So, that's what it's looking like so far. 
and um yeah you know i wanted to be on the beach but i'm saying in the water a little bit but you know it is the weather it is october so you know what i mean how their seasons change our seasons change too so but it does look like a little flea market so i don't know i wasn't gonna get off the boat but if i get off the boat it won't be that long it's just to just to see what they have just to experience it you know even though i really want to be on the beach but where we at right now i don't see anything any beach or anything nothing like that and we have very short time to do anything because we have to be back on a boat by 5 30 and it's already 12 something right now so um we'll see we'll see how it goes and see how much footage i can do or even if i'm going to get off the boat um so we'll see but i got a lot of footage this trip i'm having a lot of fun though like and i tell like i think i'm gonna do like a uh like what you should like what you could get away with and what you shouldn't buy what you need to buy and things like that so i'll check in with your phone mm -hmm. <laughs> Say that shit. I suggest you go on, find someone basic. I've been writing all the.